Hey guys, this is Megan Hilton. This is part of the Geeks and Beauties Halloween collab. We're going to start out with a full face of makeup. We're going to take half of it off. Okay, so now we have one half of our makeup look off. You'll see why in a second. <laughs> okay, we're going to take uh, Bin Nye liquid latex and tissue paper. We're going to map out kind of where you want the wound to be because I'm, do I'm doing like a big gaping wound on my cheek. Kind of like a, it's a, the idea is like a half glam, half burned, wounded face kind of look. I don't know what I was really going for, but I like it. So um, I mapped out where I want this to be. I put the tissue paper down. That's the bottom layer. You're gonna pat that, and you're gonna keep stacking and stacking until you get the desired thickness. There we go. This is what it looks like after I've stacked it all up. It has the liquid latex is dried. You're gonna take whatever foundation and you're just going to cover that. Um, this is going to look like it doesn't match my skin because of the tissue paper it's on, but it matches well, I promise, <laughs> um, in real life. So we're going to take scissors, you're going to cut open that wound. Make sure you don't cut your real skin, be very careful. If you're, if you're younger, have somebody help you. So now I've ripped open what I want to be open, and you take your foundation, you cover that up. Now I'm taking one of my Ben 9 wheels. This is the cream contour wheel, the olive light medium one, and I'm taking the black shade and I'm putting that inside of the wound so that it gives it kind of like some depth. Now I'm taking another wheel. This is the uh, Bruise and Abrasions wheel. I'm taking the red in that one. It's just a bright red shade and I'm going to put that down on top of that and actually all over the wound to kind of make it look, you know, like bloody and scabby. Now I'm taking this kind of like bluish dark kind of shade it's not black, but it's not like exactly blue. I'm taking that and putting that down on top of the whole thing as well to kind of give it some depth. Okay, this is what we have so far. Now I'm taking the Ben Knight Nose and Scar Wax and of course my Spirit Gum, also from Ben Knight. And I'm going to put that along the edges. Be careful with having Spirit Gum so close to the eye. This probably wasn't a good idea. But um, I just want to give some more depth, you know. So now I'm putting down the Nose and Scar Wax. And I'm just kind of putting that, I'm going to work that all the way around the edges. You saw Garrett in the background there. <laughs> okay, so now that I've done that, I'm just going to take the same colors I worked on the inside of that scab. So I'm doing the black, and then I'm doing the red, and then the other shade, that like bluish shade. And I'm just layering it on top of that to really make it look like a scab. There we go. And now I'm making like ouchy faces. <laughs> I'm taking a stippling brush and I'm doing the same thing now. I'm just actually I'm taking the red and I'm darkening up that inside part just to really get it and make sure everything's covered. As you see, once the, the flaps kind of open more and then more is left exposed with the tissue, so you have to make sure everything's covered up. Now I'm going to be taking the liquid latex and making some like blood drops, basically. Um, you'll see what I mean in a second, but I wanted some actual blood drops that looked like everything was actively bleeding, so I put some uh, some liquid latex down and it takes a while for them to dry when they're drips like this but um, you'll see when I come back it looks really cool so this is wet now I'm gonna go away I think there I came back they are dry now and I'm going to use the same shades before and I'm going to just cover the rest of my face half of my face so the black then the red and then that dark shade so now what I'm doing that I didn't show you is I'm using the Ben Nye uh, dark blood and it's a really good blood and I'm putting that all over my face. I'm just really making sure that everything looks really gross and really gory. You can take it down your neck if you want, but that is the completed look. And I just wanted to let you guys know to check out everyone else's videos in this collab. And you should also check out um, my link in the description for the November Walking Dead themed Zany Laney Wax Box because um, this is kind of like a that kind of a look and yeah, you know, I just wanted to shout it out. You can use my code that's Megan Hope 10 to save some moolah. 
and um, that is all down in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I had a lot of fun. I know this look isn't perfect, but I think it was a lot of fun. So, yeah. <laughs> if you guys have any questions about specific products, put them down below. Thank you so much for watching. This is Megan Helt out.